Back in action, we're back in the action, boys. Real quick, if you guys want to give this video a big thumbs up, comment down below. It helps us grow. We are the only jewelry channel, almost, on YouTube, I'm pretty sure, and uh, it's hard to grow from that, so thank you. YouTube is also not sharing me because my humor sucks, apparently, so if you guys want to give a thumbs up, comment down below. Once again, thank you. Also, man, this video is brought to you by our multi-billion dollar company, NameBrandFam.com. <laughs> Just kidding. It sounded pretty sweet, though. If you guys like jewelry, go check it out. What we sell on there is fake jewelry. However, I handpick it myself. I try to pick out the best pieces and I also give you guys the best price that I can while still making a little bit of profit so if you guys go on there you'll see all the jewelry is free all you have to do is pay shipping now you could also add two free things to your cart for the price of one shipping so don't just add one thing and pay for the shipping add two things pay for the shipping we also have items on there you can pay for for example you search up watch you can pay for the watch you can also add a free thing in your cart for the price of one shipping so namebrandfan.com we appreciate you uh good thanks all right, boys, so I am very stoked, actually, for this video. I say it always, but I, I like the content. That's good, because we don't brand. Uh, okay. So, you guys have probably heard of memorial pendants or, like, memory pendants before. I'll put a picture up right here if you guys haven't. They're real popular right now. Generally, you see websites selling them of, like, Nipsey Hussle, Tupac, uh, you know, passed away rappers. A lot of people get their family members in them. Now, I've actually been wanting to get one for a little while. I've kind of been on the edge because they seem a little goofy to me, but I have my reasons, I'll explain why I kind of want to get one later. Anyway, as you guys may or may not know, my dad passed away freaking four years ago by now, nuts, and I kind of wanted to get one for him, but a real one, you know what I mean? Like, we're talking, it's a little bit of bucks, you got a lot of diamonds on those things, it's straight up solid gold, it's a lot. So I have this picture in mind that I want to get done. I'm going to just pull out the phone. It's this one right here, this is just off my Instagram, that's my mom and my dad together, hopefully y'all can see but that one right there, come on. That one right there, my pops. Now the reason I'm showing it to you that way is because I used to have the real copy of that picture as you guys saw it was in my hand. However, I, just somebody like pickpocketed me at one point or something, I, my wallet got jacked and it was in my wallet. I always kept it with me and it, that sucks, you know what I mean? So I don't have that picture anymore. I also lost 600 bucks American in my wallet because I just got back from a trip. Also sucks. By the way, whoever has my wallet, if you're watching the video, I will give you a grand for that picture back, please. Anyway, I really wanted to get one of those pennies. Uh, with that picture of my dad. The only thing is hard because I don't have the picture and these companies have been like, yo, like we need an actual solid photo to get this work done. You know what I mean? To put the picture in the pendant. All I have of that picture left is literally that picture y'all saw on Instagram. So all the companies are like, oh, well, I don't know if we can do it. It might be too low resolution. I'm like, well, freaking check for me and we'll have to drop a bag on this. So what are you doing? So nobody's replied back. I've taken it on myself to test it myself so I don't waste my money and we'll see if it actually looks good. So what we did is I bought a fake one to test from Amazon. I'm gonna print off that picture. We're gonna resize it. I was gonna do this anyway. I was like, I may as well make a video. And then I'm gonna ask you guys down below, is it worth going through? Like, does the quality look nice? Did it or not? Because it is gonna be blurry. It's from an Instagram photo. Is it worth going through with? You know what I mean? Are you guys following? I don't know. Uh, but yeah, no, uh, the reason I really wanted to get that picture is because one, my dad looks freaking cool in it. <laughs> and also, um, it, it kind of reminds me like when I was like a kid getting my new passport and stuff like that, we always had this joke. And if you look at his face right here, he looks like mad stern. I don't know if it was what he was trying to do there or what. But generally with our passport photos, when we went to get them, we'd always like have this joke of like, let's just look crazy in it. So like nostrils flare, just like something like that <laughs> and he would do it too and so that one really reminds me of it also the fact that I lost it um he really that hurts a little bit so I felt like even if I didn't wear this piece a lot because it was kind of goofy this is like something that I could really keep and cherish in like a overall really cool way all right, so let's get into it. It's just a cheap one, just to test um, once I print this off in the printer and kind of see how it looks. Cause no company is willing to do it for me, idiots. Y'all missing out. Okay, right there, that's a big bag for a little piece. This is huge, actually. <laughs> That's a, that's a statement right there. Now, if I were to get this real, I probably wouldn't get a big one like this. I think it's like way too flashy. I'd probably get one of those small ones like this. But as y'all could see, that is what we're working with right now. God, is that my nail hanging off? That's a huge hangout. Don't do it. Ballsy. Didn't even peel back my finger. Let's go. Anyway, that's what we're testing with today. So if you guys don't know, you open her up somehow. There we go. That comes out 
you have this right here. And I just popped out the screen. Great. Oh, this is great quality. This is great quality. Look at that. There's glue marks all over it. At least it's a testing. That's what we're looking at. This is exactly what I want, but I want it a little bit smaller, maybe white gold, not sure. But we're gonna test it out. We're gonna take this picture of my dad to Photoshop right here. We're gonna print her out. We're gonna cut her out. Go. All right, boys, been working on this for a little bit. Look at that guy. What a freaking boss. He must have known he was just gonna get a screwed up son. He's like, oh man, I'm screwed. That's probably the day he found out he was gonna have me. Anyway, color corrected a little bit. I think I got it to the right size. So we're gonna take it to the printer now because nobody else is willing to do it. Once again, if there's any jewelry companies watching that also wanna hook me up on a price, I'm down ski. God, you zoomed in, you idiot. Anyway, <coughs> uh, cool, off to the printer. Now watch his name brand takes that puny little girl finger of his and press his print. Y'all probably didn't know you were watching a tech expert, did ya? All right, while we wait for that printer to set up, it takes forever. Uh, I actually just wanted to show you guys, we got a new jewelry box right here. It was like 40 bucks on Amazon. I wanted to show y'all, that's kind of like what we got going on with it. We got the watch, we got the Shop GLD watch in there we use for videos. It just looks real nice because it's diamond. Everything else is real in it. We got the teeth right there. This little spot here for all my rings is Dope. You guys let me know what you think about that. I think it's pretty sick. We got this chain right here. We got this one. Also, this one's fake, but this is what we sold at one point. Sterling silver. Just fake diamonds. And we got an extra compartment for a drug. She's printing. She's printing. Let's go. You never know when that bitch is gonna work or not. Oh yeah, I got stickers on my printer myself. <laughs> Let's go. Here she is. So we have the picture out right now. Now keep in mind, it doesn't look horrible. Um, obviously if I were to get this real, I'd want it to look a lot better. I think they would use glossy pictures or whatever the heck with probably a lot better printer. So this is just a test and once again, I want you guys to let me know if we should go through with it at the end. But I think with looking at this, it should be a good size. It's not gonna get his whole body in it or anything like that, but it'll definitely get his face a little bit of that neck area as well. I don't know what kind of coat you're wearing, bro. What is that? Oh, wow, you look like a Jedi Knight, this is nice. There's one thing left, bro, we gotta cut the circle to fit the piece. That's the new piece? <laughs> All right, boys, Kraftski is done. Uh, it's a little close up, maybe that's how I want it when I get the other one, who knows, if I do get it, so hopefully it fits in there. Which it does, let's go. I never make it on the first try with anything. This is great. And then, we're gonna close her up. It's upside down, you dumb ass. And that's, I think I would probably, yeah, I'd make the picture a little bit smaller if I were to get it real, but that's how she looks right there. I think with better quality, a smaller pendant, smaller picture, I think it might look a lot better. All those glue marks are awful. What are you doing? What are you, like, what are you doing? What did you glue that with? Elmer's? Like, you, we know that stuff dries white, right? Anyway. That's kind of what I was thinking. Now that I look at it, I might want to get it done. Like I say, maybe I won't zoom in the picture so much and also get a smaller pendant. This is way too much. If I just got one, maybe something like that, like just a lot smaller and less zoomed in on his face. I think it'd be really cool and just kind of a keepsake of like, cause I did lose that picture of him, which I'd still kick myself for. Um, I can have this like really cool, like memory piece. You know what I mean? Wearing it or not, it's just like, I'll always have that picture. It might turn out well, bro. I'm not gonna lie. If you guys know any jewelers that are down to hook me up, I, you don't, they don't have to, but I'm definitely like, that'd be dope. Anyway, man, you guys let me know. Should I go through with it or not? Leave a thumbs up and a comment if I should. If I shouldn't, leave a comment about it and a thumbs up that I shouldn't. So <laughs> either way, leave a thumbs up and a comment, please. I appreciate y'all for watching. Just a little, uh, what day is it today? A little Friday video. Friday, Saturday, don't know. A little Friday video. A little Friday video for the for the boys. Lazy day. Lazy day. I need to get this done. So appreciate y'all for watching. Merc of the game, the greatest of all time. Dad, love you, brother. And uh, catch y'all later. Plow.